Previous mission, you repelled an insurgent attack and captured the enemy's leader. As a Turk in the field, you must be capable of assessing a situation and making sound judgments. Now then, what should be done with it? Correct. Considering what we know of the situation, it seems unlikely that the insurgents' ultimate objective was the town's occupation. Which leaves us with some questions. What only our detainee can answer. Uh, what? Why? I'll spare you the details. A productive interrogation revealed to us the truth. The attack on Paul was only intended to be a diversion. One which drew us away from their real target, Junon's weapon system. Suffice it to say, their plan worked. Consequently, they have seized control of our autonomous sentry unit. Your mission is to neutralize the mechanical threat. Best of luck to you out there. So their mechs were hijacked and turned against them? <laughs> Sucks to be them. It is a core tenet of Turk's doctrine that one must anticipate and prepare for every contingency. Yeah, they're never caught flat-footed, that's for sure. It's 
on you. All right. You're up. Here I go. Come on. Forces are, without question, the world's greatest military power. However, our superior strength could well prove our undoing if our enemies succeeded in turning assets against us. We must deny them the opportunity, and if we fail, we must rectify the situation. This facility will enter power saving mode. Once you have retrieved your provisions, proceed to the next location. Excellent work. My analysis is progressing smoothly, but I fear I require more data to arrive at a conclusion. What? We're still not done yet? Just a little more. is supposed to be able to do anything, right? Why do they need more than one? Previously, each unit had a facility reserved for them alone. But as an energy-saving measure, they can now only be used one at a time, and in order. One at a time? Cheapskates. 